Okay, this is a demo about using a Spark Go amplifier as an effects pedal and uh, input device for Blues Harp. Uh, Honer Rocket there, key of A. Um, part of the goal here was I want to keep it lightweight, compact, uh, easy to hold as far as the microphone. Uh, things I already had were these uh, Behringer C2s. You hear me on one of them. The other one is uh, facing my Bose S1 amplifier there. Um, had this uh, Sennheiser mic. I thought about using it, but man, the thing is heavy. It's like 357 grams, which is about three quarters of a pound. And size of the ball on the end makes it hard to hang on to it just too much right and that it would uh, wear your arm out by the end of the evening so in the uh, junk box of parts around here i had this audio technica atr 20 microphone the thing is like universally panned by everybody it's just a cheap consumer grade mic for podcasting and whatnot, but people complain about it because they have low output. But plastic body, it's really light, 155 grams. I mean, it's, uh, what, four ounces, something like that? Um, a bit more, perhaps, but, you know, it, it's nice, and it's lightweight, and it feels good in your hand, easy to hold with the harp. So I thought, well, what the heck? I'll give it a shot. Um, the Spark Go, 365 grams. Again, about three quarters of a pound. 12-ish uh, ounces, I guess. And uh, the challenge was to set up four presets here. And if you see the little light as it toggles there. There's two, three, four, one and get it so that they would all basically be at the same volume. <clears throat> so uh, the first one's got just a little reverb. Second one's got some reverb and delay. Third one's got a lot of delay. The fourth one's like crazy overdrive and whatnot. Um, it's like the total rock harmonica. So what I'm going to do... I'm going to dial down the uh, mic that I'm speaking into here. The one you see on the left. Oh, by the way, iRig Pro Duo. Good unit. Uh, I'm monitoring on my headphones here. Helps when you practice because you hear your mistakes better. Um, it's got outputs that I can run directly into the PA. And then I'm going into an iPhone here <clears throat> for this particular video, but you can use it on a computer, um, tablets, whatever. It's a good piece of kit and it's got uh, phantom power on it so I'm able to use this condenser mic. All right so I'm going to dial this down and uh, play a little bit so that you hear the four different presets.
All right, so there you have it. Four different uh, examples of presets all in one box. Going from uh, gentle to extra crunchy. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Again, great little unit it seems. Um, volume control adjustment here if you need it. But by getting those four pedals dialed in at the same volume, they really don't have to reach for it much. So I think it's going to be a neat addition to my kit.